G'day, y'all. Um, <laughs> every time I do one of these videos, it gets more and more insane. I can't even see over the stuff that you've said. Can you even see me? Hi, hello. I just want to thank everyone for this stupidity. You, uh, you really have to stop. And I have to stop telling you to stop because every time I tell you to stop, you don't stop. It just gets worse. I'm going to shut up. Oh, this is going to end up becoming a three-part video. I'm going to take all this stuff off the table. I only put it on the table for dramatic effect. If you want to send mail to the show, um, don't. <laughs> By popular request, I bought the green screen back. <laughs> I'm just going to make it a staple. Also, I got rid of those other energy drinks that I was drinking because screw them. <laughs> They didn't want to sponsor me. So instead, we're trying highball today for the very first time. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. That is awful. <laughs> ah, I'm not going to do letters in these videos anymore. Up until now, I've opened every letter in the video. But everyone ends up becoming, I open it, and the first words that I read out are, Please don't read this on camera because it's personal and it just ends up slowing down the videos even more. So it's going to be nicer for me to actually sit down and read these in my own time anyway. Thank you though. I appreciate it. Oh, by the way, don't you love our location? I'm going to make the editor work for his money in this video. <laughs> Digital Smart Light. Holinox. <gasps> Whoa, this is really cool. This is like exactly the same um, LED. That's in the it looks like a little LED Zelda light, which I think I have to remove this sticker off the back. But once I have done that, I can change it to any color. Oh, why do I always forget a knife? Yeah, I'm a danger to myself and everyone around me. <laughs> I'm not good with knives. Oh, 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 oh. I kind of thought it was going to be one of these because I got sent this pizza box once before, but it was like back to the future. Majora's Mask. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you so much. I'm going to have to put this up with my Zelda stuff. I put my back to the future one in my back to the future room. I saw these pieces and immediately thought of you. Hope you enjoyed them, Oscar. Thank you so much, Oscar. I love them. I can't wait to see what the Zelda light looks like all lit up. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Let's keep this swift and moving. Let's keep things snippity snappity. These videos, um, people seem to either like love them or hate them at this point. I love them. <laughs> Whether you send me stuff or you enjoy these videos, just thanks for being a part of this. It means a lot to me. What is this? Has someone made me a blanket? Cherry blossom flower. <gasps> I think this is for Kim. I think Kim might have got her first fan mail. Calm supplement candy coated pieces to help you relax. Well, Kim and I can share those. Either Kim just got her first fan mail or someone sent me um, face masks, which, you know, <laughs> maybe you're trying to say something about my skin. Hi, it's Annabella again. I joined your Patreon and I was so excited you read my letter. My cousin Genesis, wow, that's a cool name. Myself and my grandpa Davis watched some of your videos together. And so my grand, oh, my grandma made this for you. That's so nice. I work at Whole Foods and I get a few of these supplements as samples. I tried some and they work. They help me calm down. I thought you might like them. And the face masks are for Kim. And you if you want them. Your grandma made me a blanket. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna cry. That's so nice. <laughs> Stupid. Thanks, grandma. <laughs> There's so many face masks. Yeah, Kim actually does face masks like every night. And sometimes she makes me do the nose strip things. They pull a lot of gross stuff out of my nose. And these calming chocolates, I take one now. But I'm actually trying to do the reverse of it. But after this, I'm gonna counteract this peach water. I bought three of these and I regret that. Okay, I know you just got home from work, but I just opened all of this stuff and there was a few things for you. So I'm gonna hand them to you. These are from Annabelle or Annabella. I'm bad at names. Bunch of face masks. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look, wait, one? you missed one. <laughs> That so one's yours. We can do those together. Cool. And she Thank also you. got us these chocolates that help your mood. Oh, and uh, they look really cool. cool. Yeah. And she watches the show with her grandma. Aww. And her grandma made us that blanket. What? Oh. Look at it. Oh, it's so cute. I may or may not have shed a tear. I mean, I would. Somebody makes you a blanket. Someone's, you cry a little. Someone's yeah. Mima made us a freaking blanket. I'm gonna put it on the blanket oh, ladder that I made you. Yeah, thank you. It's I so nice. It. Okay, I'm gonna do some of these smaller packages and pretend like I didn't just cry. Hmm, I am a man, baby. The comments are right. Hey, Wood, hope you enjoy this rare game. Be careful though, because of the maturity rating. Kim is a lucky girl. Audrey from Ohio. Wow, Mario goes to the fridge to get a glass of milk deluxe. <laughs> 
<laughs> New Funky Kong modes. Up to four players, DLC characters included, customizable milk, over 160 courses. I'm kind of scared as to what's inside. Oh, they even kind of made a little cartridge. Limited edition three of 1,000. Wow, one of the first prints too. Thank you so much. I don't really get the meme, milk. but I understand what you have done and I appreciate it so much. And Kim, is a lucky girl. <laughs> one, two, three, one. That is my PO box number, so I don't know why I read it out loud. It is from Jack Hill. Please don't, and then I, I don't know, don't want. Probably please don't bend. I'm gonna assume please don't bend. That wasn't me that bent it, by the way. It got shoved in my post box this way. I think it's fan art. <gasps> the rare fan art. Maybe, let's not get too excited. Oh, it is. Yeah. Someone's colored in a Zeldies for me. And I colored in a Yoshi's for Kim. Dear Wooden Kim, I made you each a picture of my lunch breaks at work. Yes, I'm a grown adult coloring pic. Hey, that's fine. Kim and I do crafts together sometimes. We made snow globes the other day. That's irrelevant, but sometimes we color things. So send to my favorite YouTuber, don't at me. Anyways, love your videos, Wooden. I appreciate the way you convinced me to buy a Switch and what epic games to get. Thank you so much. They're going on the fridge. I mean that. Well, I don't know where Kim wants to put her Yoshi, but I'm gonna put mine on my fridge. Okay, what did you just find? I said, where did you get these? These are nice. And I said, that one's mine. Oh, Although, I'm gonna put it on the fridge, but that one's yeah. yours. I think we should put them both on the fridge. Yeah. Get B-roll of the fridge. Okay, let's go get B-roll of the fridge. B-roll of the fridge. Let's go. Yeah, yeah that's good. Yep. It's adorable. Thanks. Thank you. I love you. And now, I'd like to take you to one of my favorite locations. This location, oh. It's just somewhere I like to go and relax, just chill out on a nice, rainy day. I love this place. I'm really asking for it now. <laughs> Be nice, Vincent Vinny editor, editor Vinny, Brad Vinny, Brad Two Vinny, Brinny Vinny One, Brinny. Damn it! Just gave you a new nickname, Brinny. <laughs> Come and visit Tuberbrook. I would spare Shaw Shaw can DLC for Mario um, pfft, Mario Kart Mortal Kombat 11 Switch. Use or add to your giveaway. I'm really lazy, so I'm just gonna say the word C02Y4P4Q5LTGP9H9. If you have Mortal Kombat 11 for Switch and you're the first one to put that in, then go for it. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. I might put that in the giveaway pile because what's Kim's is mine's and what mine's is Kim's, and I don't think we need. Two. But thank you. We did buy two copies of Dragon Quest Builders though. She hasn't started hers yet, but I, I, I want her to. Oh, uh, we got letters? We got letters. And I can already see this is from Matthew Hennigan, so it's probably gonna be good. <laughs> we have the Zelda 30th anniversary concert. Holy moly. The extra moly. Hold the holy. What is this? Oh man, so gorgeous. Concert 2018 is all I can actually read and the words Blu-ray. I'm assuming some limited edition Zelda thingy from Japan because I'm just so observantly smart. <laughs> it took a real genius to figure that one out. What do you want me to say, Matthew? You always send me the coolest stuff and it's usually always Zelda stuff. At this point, I need a Zelda room and you're not making that any better. I would enjoy your gift from Matthew C. Hennigan. Thank you, Matthew. Ah, the aftertaste gets you. Uh, Mm. A package from Vincent. Not editor Vincent, because as we all know, his name is Brinny now. But it's from Texas. He's in like Portugal. Speaking of Portugal, beautiful place. I have no idea what it looks like. Uh, wow, I don't have this Switch game. I've actually never even heard of it before. Strictly limited. I would, I really enjoy watching your videos. They make me laugh and put me in a much better mood. My favorite videos are the top 10 eShop videos. Ah, me too. I do believe you have this one. Um, I don't have this one. Thank you so much, Vince. I've actually never even seen this game before. Like, period. And it comes with a little postcard. Thank you, Vinny. Two packages on the floor. My voice broke for a second there. Feudal alloy. Wow, I pronounced both those words terribly. It looks like a book. I don't read. I actually read a book the other day. Can I open it? Who am I asking for permission? <laughs> Who in here is gonna say no? No! I was too eager to see what this book could be. So I didn't check for a note. Thankfully, it looks like they were left inside. Nope, it's just a bunch of stickers. And these stickers look really cool. And there's a Switch code. Oh, it's an art book for a game that I don't have. Oh! Oh, that makes so much sense. It's artwork. It's not a stupid book with words. It's a great book with pictures. And an even better book because it has a switch key at the end for me to download the game. Where did the pa 
Where did it come from? Oh, Atu Games? I think it literally came from the dev. Atu Games, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. This game legitimately looks good, and the artwork in this thing is cool, and the stickers are awesome, and I can't wait to play it. Thank you so much. I did not expect that. Be honest, companies and devs that make Switch games really don't seem to care that I exist most of the time. So, I mean, I appreciate it. Um, from uh, a generic company, I believe. Oh, it's a Switch case. Oh, I can like feel the sweat. Ha, huh. yeah. Ah, um, Zelda Breath of the Wild. You got some little silicone molds to throw your Joy-Cons into, some buttons to put on there. Thank you so much. That is so epic. I don't know who that was from either. There was no note in that one and I did check that time. From Wen Hao He literally how that it, I'm assuming that's pronounced. Thank you so much. Please leave notes. Just like Google image search me holding this and maybe it'll come up. All right, big box. Oh my great giddy end. Oh, it's from Sarah. She t oh. oh, it's from Sarah. <laughs> to say that less weird. I really hope this gets to you in one piece, fingers crossed. She told me she was sending me something. I do believe that this is in one piece. Triforce mirror. This is what I mean, guys. I literally need a Zelda room at this point. There's a room right across from me that I can stare into from here that's literally filled with spare junk. So maybe I'm just gonna repurpose that as a Zelda room. I'm actually really scared to take this out. I'll let you know it's definitely in one piece. So we'll see if I have the gusto to take it out in the B-roll. And if you're not seeing it now, then I was scared to take it out. Ooh. I don't know where we're gonna put it. I mean, there's a multitude of places that you could hang that up. I was thinking of- Oh! You know where I absolutely hate? You know what place I loathe? A place I never want to go to? A place I stay away from because it just sucks? This place. Oh. Sucks. Decor for a laptop, for a phone, for a mini, mini, uh, a smaller iPad thing. Oh, it's just a bunch of gadget decals. You can put them on anything. You got a fancy letter. It's even signed at the bottom. Chris! Hi there, Wood. I discovered your channel only recently, but became an avid subscriber very fast and watched dozens of your older videos. Uh, since my... Every time I make a sound like that, I worry about what my editor might do with it now. <sighs> Since my childhood, I'm a big fan of Zeldies myself. I have fond memories of playing Link's Awakening on Game Boy, and you really revived my interest in that again. Attached to you, I'll find a small gift, which I hope you enjoy. Oh, from Germany. A lot of Germans today. I'm gonna sticky stick those on everything that they can be sticky stuck on. You guys got to see this one before me. Because I pull it out the wrong way. Oh, it's like embroider embroidered at Joy-Cons in the shape of my... Hey Wood, thank you so much for all you do. I watched you for over a year and a half. You brought me lots of joy. I wanted to make you something very special. Chi Chi the Kitty. Thank you so much. That's a great name too. This is amazing. How did you make this? I mean, probably just by like stitching, right? I have no frame of reference for how this kind of stuff is done. But thank you. That's really neato. I'm gonna put that in my office. Did I really just say neato? Wow. <sighs> so this is from... They contacted you. Be careful. Uh, and then inside here, our dwelling place, the trials of Jesus. Jesus? The YouTube channel Janice Click, Click has been known to cause violent tendencies and cult like behavior. Videos on this channel are not suitable for anyone. Please, Please help, help us. us. This ad has been sponsored by Christians Against Janice Click. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm never watching this. <laughs> I mean, I don't have a VHS player for it anyway. If you guys remember the video I did with Billy where we opened that package and it was like horrifically frightening. Dude, this is for you. Oh, it's no, I ain't touching that. That's haunted. Really? You like That's haunted. What the? If you want that, no, I ain't touching it. Please take you it out of my house. No, 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 no. I don't know. And I'm gonna assume that it's just from the same place. And I'm trying really hard not to get freaked out by this because it was all fun and games when Billy was here. But right now, I'm alone in the house. Yeah, moving on. Um, editor, please take me to my safe place. Oh, that's better. There has to be something a little smaller. No, I don't think so. Okay. Oh, they're right here on my table. Why does my voice go so high in these videos? What? Oh! 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 This must be from like Callus themselves. Oh! I feel so bad. I don't know when they sent this, but they messaged me a while ago. So this is from Nykalis themselves, which is 
really freaking cool. I know I said this was feudal alloy, but like most of the time companies, I don't know why they don't care that I exist. It's fine. I'm going to review the games anyway, and maybe that's why. But Nikalis actually reached out to me. Oh, I reached out to them. I can't remember. It was a while ago. And they said, did you want to, or I said, do you make some really freaking amazing games? And they were like, okay, give us your PO box. This is awesome. I don't think I ever actually bought this physically. So that's mine. I actually already had these. So we might be able to do a giveaway for those bad boys. They even come with all the cool stuff. I got to check to make sure mine come with the cool stuff. But this, holy moly. I did have the original, like the normal of this, but this is like a huge box. I wonder what comes inside. I didn't know they even sold this. So there's the game. <gasps> Which has a different cover on it. What? And then, oh, like some actual like bricks too. Thank you so much, like Alice. I'm sorry it took me so long. You probably sent this like two months ago. Oh, by the way, I know in the last video, I did a bunch of giveaways that I forgot to actually make giveaways for. So they're going to be down below in this video. It was Kim's birthday when I put that video up and I was like, ah, so they're in this one from the last one. <gasps> It's a sign Zeldies from, I'm assuming, Zeldi herself. Hey, Wood, greetings from the UK. I've enclosed something you might like. This package contains two promotional art cards that were given away with Breath of the Wild pre-orders in UK. The Zelda side has been signed by Patricia, that was her name, Somerset, the voice actress of Princess Zelda herself, and I had it signed with the intention of sending it to you. Oh, thank you so much, James. James, that is incredible. As I wipe the sweat from my brow in your honor, I just want to say this is really heartfelt and thank you so much. This is probably going to have to get a little frame. That is kind of perfect, but that would be horribly mean. <laughs> but I'm going to have to get a frame for it of some kind. Thank you so much. That's awesome. I'm going to drink as much of this as I can because I'm running low on energy. As long as you keep drinking it, it kind of does taste like peach. It's just as soon as you stop, it tastes like Gamer Girl bathwater. <laughs> Oh, what? Oh, no. This is expensive, man. Come on. I would a placeholder until the one terabyte cards get out. Your card troll! <laughs> Who is that? What eShop games are you worth going back and playing again? Any that I did in my videos, card troll. Ah! Um, honestly, I have been looking into getting a 400 gigabyte. I only have like a 128, and it's clearly not enough for a man of my stature. So... Thank you. Usually when I do these videos, I'm so like cautious about how I like, but I feel like I've just kind of, I'm trying to be quick. Like literally the two part video was like three hours long. You know how hard that was to get down to a reasonable length? So I'm just like, and I'm trying my best at the same time not to make it seem like I'm rushing them because they all mean so freaking much to me. The Zelda room is gonna end up having to become a thing. What? It, oh, this is really cool. Does someone make this? Or is this... This isn't the thing from the one thing, is it? Oh, it's a massive notepad I can write my hopes and dreams on and draw unicorns. What is this? Oh! Uchi Mama! That is cool. I didn't know they did a four pack in one. I have them all separately. Oh, little lights. These can go on my computer desk. My nose is running. I got boogers. This was a long time in the making, so sorry about that. You now have a set for use and one for display. Oh, Uma, really? And I hope you see this first as opposed to the second parcel. I think I did. Uma, forever ago, he was the one that actually sent me the other ones. And now he sent them to me again, so I can actually use the other ones, which I won't. Just because I have a different version of them doesn't mean the other ones are any less cool individually. They look better in the boxes. And now we're here. Where are we now? Hi, Wood. I've been keeping an eye out on the Masters Edition. If anyone should have this in their collection, it's you, Steven. How big is it? I can feel my fat. Oh, it's so big. Oh, it's the actual. What? Oh, I forgot about this one. The other day, I went to um, a game store near me. Really great game store. Link on my Instagram. And I actually finally bought the special edition. And I remember while I was buying it, I was like, I really wanted this on launch. But there was two. There was the special edition and there was something else. And I could not remember what the something else was. And I saw the special, so I grabbed that. This was it. There was a master edition. It sold out immediately on pre-order. And I don't know what's in it. And like, I'm really... I, you guys know me. I really don't want to open it and find out. But I think I will. 
I don't know. I realize how dumb it is that I, I literally have it sat on my lap and I'm Googling to find out what's inside it. Oh, it came with the master sword in the stone. That's inside here and I'll never see it? I don't know. I might open it, guys. I'm just gonna open it. Okay, this is gonna... Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> the collector in me at least needs to know what this is worth sealed. Are you kidding me, Steven? I don't know if it's like tacky to say this, but I have made a big deal about it at this point. I'm seeing anywhere between five to like $900. Let me try and explain something to you. I am a collector at heart. That's why I keep all my things in packages as much as I can. If it has a seal, I hate breaking that seal. I don't know why it's the collector in me. I do it with a lot of figures. Like I have a Turbo Man that Kim got me for Christmas. I'm not opening that bad boy. And like, what am I gonna do? Play with it for a little bit? And like, as much as I want to put that sword on display, the collector in me can't break a seal on something that expensive and maybe I'll change my mind on that later But I'm not rushing into that commitment right now. Steven's getting a talking to later. I love it Steven. I you know, you know I love it. Oh, I'm making such a mess. I hate that I've made this mess I hate that I now have to reach my hand inside a box and pull out a It better not be like sharp ah! There's actually a store near me that sells this and I really wanted it, but um, you know, expensive. So I didn't buy it. Carlos Collection. I'm gonna have to like do a deep dive for a note. No, nope, I don't see a note. I do see a lot of packing peanuts. These packing peanuts feel kind of nice between my toes. That's right, I'm barefoot. Didn't expect that, did ya? So this is the Dark Master Sword. I don't know if it has like an actual name. And I know like as a massive Zelda fan, I'm probably losing a few geek points here. But honestly, when I went to that store, I did see this and I was like, I thought, what? Because I mean, how like how awesome it is. Hey, can you please put me in Zelda? Thank you. I actually have a master sword and this is gonna look really cool next to it. I've been tossing up the idea of actually designing a set for the show and I'm now seeing this and seeing my master sword set right there. I'm starting to think they might be pretty cool on the wall behind me. Okay, I'm like 90% sure this is the last one. This is from Enrique. Ah, uh, so this is a mixed box of goodies, which I assumed <laughs> we have a poster, most 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 likely Zelda, although it kind of looks a little Metroid looking. Uh, Ike Amiibo, which I believe I have, might be a giveaway for that little tiger down below somewhere. We have an Eevee hat, which I think Kim would like. We have a Naruto hat, which I think a Naruto fan would like. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, Wolf Link amiibo outside of the box. And is that another Ike? No, that's uh... It's a Roy! Roy! <laughs> Damn it. I knew it. Oh, more of these books. So I got these last video. So there might be a book giveaway. We have NBA 2K17 on PlayStation 4 with a bunch of DLC codes in a still book. We have a yellow brick that... Ca coin brick. Coin question mark. I'm losing so many gamer points this video. Uh, Kim really likes stuffies. Oh, actually, Kim's gonna love this too. And there's my note. Oh, people love that. And I, I think she's gonna really enjoy it. Hey, Wood, used to be a long time viewer until I stopped YouTube for personal reasons. I was wondering like where he was going with that. Like you stopped watching me because my videos suck now. They do. He's put some stuff in this box that he thought I might like and that he doesn't ever use and thought you would appreciate it more than me or at least know someone who would. By the way, the 2K17 still book was supposed to be for RGT85, but I couldn't find his PO box. He doesn't have one anymore. RGT and I are really good friends. Since I'm gonna be shipping that out anyway, I'll just get his address from him and I'll ship it to him myself. And RGT85, if there's anything in this video that you do want, let me know because I'm sending you a package anyway, apparently. We have a Rick and Morty laser gun. Um, that's actually a portal gun. We have a Pokeball. Doesn't work. We, <laughs> we have a still book for Wolfenstein 2. I love Wolfenstein 2. Oh, I don't think I actually have a Rosalino Amiibo, so throw that bad boy in the Amiibo collection. We have a, another Pokeball that has a USB charge point on it. Possibly a power bank. Very cool. Um, I do not have that amiibo of Wario. A box of band-aids? No, it's not. Oh, it's an 8-bit do adapter thing for the GameCube controllers, I think. No, what is it for? I don't know. I've seen them online a bunch. I'm- it's for something. A Snow White poster. Oh, I almost burped, but it kind of turned into like a throw up in my mouth. And then a Wolverine vs. Joker. Oh, wait, these are signed. This one's limited 11 out of 100. That's really cool. I'm guessing whoever did the artwork signed them. Actually, Kim is huge on this kind of stuff too. So Kim got a lot of stuff out of this video. Enrique, thank you so much for this box of random stuff. There was some really cool things in here and a bunch of stuff I can give away and a bunch of stuff Kim likes and something from RGT85. So you're really pleasing a whole bunch of people right there, which... Oh! 
Oh, I missed an amiibo. And I don't have this one either. Corin, I believe. I know my stuff. I know my video games. Yellow brick. All right, guys, that's everything. Before this video gets too much longer, I just want to give you all a huge thank you. I appreciate all the gifts so much and it makes me all so freaking happy and I love it all. And I love being able to give you guys like this ability to send things if you love the show. Um, but at the same time, like with the channel growing so much, it's becoming a lot. And I can't keep doing all these giveaways all the time because and I don't want to sound inconsiderate, but it costs so much money to send out all of this stuff I already have. Either I need to figure out a better system or maybe just give away everything extra in like one big box. Leave that with me. I'll mull it over in my thoughts. I am like legitimately going to ask to just like scale it back to like nice letters. <laughs> as much as I love getting all this, this stuff a letter it, it means just as much to me and um i just feel i just i don't know i guess i feel guilty because i i do feel like i don't deserve it but also it's just a lot <laughs> i love this though i'm gonna put it on my couch we actually have a blanket ladder i made a blanket ladder for kim for valentine's day so i'm gonna put the blanket on the blanket ladder thank you grandma and thank you everyone for everything it means so much to me. Hope this video was fun. Vincent does a really good job at making these videos actually somewhat interesting because I feel like I'm really boring, but thank you everyone. Stop sending me things, seriously. All right, like, comment, hair flip, sweaty hair, subscribe. I like One last location.